This short video will demonstrate how to set up a recurring report in Sitka's Evergreen. Recurring reports are reports that are set up to run automatically on a regular basis. Setting up a recurring report is similar to setting up a report that is run only once. In the reporter, navigate through your folders to the template you would like to use for the recurring report. In the My Folders section, click the arrow next to Templates to expand to show your folders. Click on the folder containing your template. Check the box beside the template you wish to run. And from the drop down menu at the top, select Create a new report from selected template and click Submit. Fill in a name for your report. Remember, this report will be run multiple times, so we advise against giving your report a name that includes a specific date. Select the folder for your report definition. Fill in your filters. For any date filters, you will choose Relative Date from the drop-down menu. This allows the report to be run in relation to a date or time period, rather than running the same report over and over again. For monthly reports, make sure your Relative Date options are available in months ago rather than days. Select one or more output options. Check the box for Recurring Report. Choose your recurrence interval. For monthly reports, select one month as your interval. Check the box beside the date and time for the run time. This will uncheck the run as soon as possible option. We recommend scheduling recurring reports to run between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m. Pacific. For monthly reports, remember to set the date as the first of the next month. Add or remove any email addresses to receive the email completion notification and select the folder for your report output. Click Save Report and then OK to the confirmation box. You will be taken back to your template folder. Go to the folder you chose for your output. You will see your recurring report as a pending item with the runtime you specified. Once saved, a recurring report will run forever unless you delete it. For information on editing and deleting recurring reports, see the video Managing Reports. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.